Welcome to Italian Controversy, an online training resource for the performing arts. Have a good class. OK, Annabelle, let's start with our plie exercise. Standing in first position, sideways to the bar, arm bra bar. Just stand on the introduction. You're going to take a demi plie first, taking the arm to first position, one. Keep the arm as you stretch, two. You're going to do a rise, taking the arm to second, lowering the heel. Into grand plie, regular pour de bras, five. Six, smoothly up, seven through the demi, stretch, eight. Four count, four pour de bras, forward, finishing with the arms, fifth. So you go forward, one, two. Can you roll up the spine, three, taking the arm to fifth by four. Keeping the arm in fifth, looking away from the bar. Hold your back straight as you dare me. Stretch those Achilles. Stretch, degage arm and leg to second, low the heel and arm. Repeat the same, arm to first on the demi. Stretch, rise up, arm to second. Grand plie, regular pour de bras, six. Coming up, seven, recover on eight. Four counts to pour de bras towards the bar. One, two. Recover three, arm to fifth on four again. Holding the arm, keeping the back straight as you dare me, keeping the core engaged. Stretch, degage. We're only doing three positions, so you can close into fifth position, bra bar. If anyone struggles with a fifth, they can always do a third position, which is halfway. Um, so I think you're fine, Annabelle. So fifth position, last position, demi arm first. And stretch, rise straight up without crossing the feet and lower. Into grand plie. Six regular pour de bras, seven. Time the arm with the leg. We're gonna pour de bras away from the bar. Take the arms to fourth crossed, inside arm up. Turn the head away as you bend, recovering through first to arm fifth again, holding the arm as you demi and stretch, degage to second, close back to first and bra bar. I'm going to do a little rise at the end, taking the arm, outside arm to first, two, second arm off, three, four, open the arm, five, six, and lower seven to bra bar, eight. Have we got that? Okay, Annabelle, let's go through some notes for our PA exercise. So first of all, weight distribution. We need to have the abdominals engaged, weight pelvis nicely over the front of the feet so the back muscles the hamstrings are engaged and your glute muscles okay so as we take our first demi plie make sure any demi plie the heels must be firmly planted into the floor so we are stretching the achilles tendons that's it and then you stretch up pulling up the quad and kneecaps then we've got a rise rising up keeping weight over the balls of the feet and make sure the weight's evenly distributed on all 10 toes so we want to avoid pushing back onto the little toes, which is generally what happens, strengthening the ankle, controlling the heels down on eight. Then into grand plie. Now I want you to think of passing through your deepest demi, so don't be in a hurry to lift the heels. Go into your demi, then nature lift the heels up, that's it, so we're still stretching those Achilles. On the way up, Annabelle, can you push the heels down again? So we're constantly giving those Achilles a nice stretch. Good. Then we're gonna take our pour de bras forward, Use the bar now because any pour de bras at the bar, the legs should be vertically down to the floor so we're not swinging back or forward. So keep the weight forward, use your core muscles, take a breath and reach forward all the way down. Two. Now I would like you to roll up through each vertebrae so we're warming up the back and arm to fifth. That's it. So we're holding our posture nice and straight there, lower back. Demi plie, maintain that position. Heels down, stretching the Achilles stretch. Degage to second, low the heel and arm. That's it, the distance of your second is roughly your foot and a half. So that looks about right. So again, at no point do the heels come off the floor here. So demi plie, feel the floor with the feet and stretch. Rising up onto all 10 toes, lower down into smooth grand plie, two counts down, six and then two counts up, maintaining the posture on eight. Pour de bras towards the bar. You want to lift off the hips and bend from the waist. Go, two, that's it, sideways. Try not to lean forward too much. So imagine you've got a brick wall and a brick wall there and you're just bending sideways. Try that again, so you lift and reach to the bar. Sideways, direct, recover, arm to fifth. Head looking out generally when the arm's in fifth. 
Posture maintained, feet flat demi and stretch, good guard dégagé. And we're gonna go straight into fifth without moving the pelvis, keep the hips square. And last position, now think, every time you go in a demi-plié when you're going down, imagine someone's pulling your hair up to the ceiling, so you're lengthening the spine, keeping that posture as you take that awkward position, actually demi-plié in fifth. So demi, so we're rotating from the hips. Good girl, stretch. Rising up without crossing as we're coming straight down, pushing the heels forward into your grand plié. Again, same principle in first. Resist the heels, smoothly down, pushing the heels down again, good, and open. Arms to fourth cross, make sure the arms hit the position and then it flows into the pulled bra side without sinking, and then recover through first to arm fifth. That's the one, and then demi-plié again, maintaining the posture, good girl, and stretch. Just be careful when you demi-plié there, don't roll on the back foot. There we go, so the arches are, supported. Degage back to first and close. Into a rise, keeping weight over the balls of the feet, core muscles engaged, arm first. Keep breathing but keep your core engaged. Let go and balance. Now just isolate the movement, open the arms to second and then keeping the weight over the balls of the feet at sit so we're resisting the heels down beautifully. Well done. Squeeze out the demi arm first, stretch, rise arm to second, and lower. Grand plié, use the whole phrasing, and up, recover on eight. Reaching forward, pour de bras, rolling up the spine, arm to fifth, and held. Back straight, stretch, dégagé, lower the heel and arm, repeat, demi. Rising up on all ten toes, lower. Now feel the floor of the feet into the floor. All counts towards the bar. One, two, recover three, and place four. Demi, knees out, and dégagé straight into fifth. And now lift the body and rise into your grand plié. And we're taking the pulled bra away from the bar. Arms fourth crossed. Two, three, and fifth. Knees out. Stretch. Degage back to first. Slow rise up. Keeping over the toes. Tummy zipped. And test. Good girl. Now isolate the movement. Open to second. And finish. Raising and up, recover on eight. Reaching forward, pour de bras. Rolling up the spine, arm to fifth and held. Back straight, stretch, dégagé, lower the heel and arm, repeat. Demi. Rising up on all ten toes, lower. Now feel the floor of the feet into the floor. All counts towards the bar, one. Two, recover three, and place four. Demi, knees out, and dégagé, straight into fifth. And now lift the body, and rise into your grand plié. And we're taking a pulled bra away from the bar, arms fourth crossed. Two, three, and fifth. Knees out, stretch, dégagé back to first. Slow rise up, keeping over the toes, tummy zipped, and test, good girl. Now isolate the movement, open to second. Okay, let's take our back montanju um, with change of legs. So we've got to be aware about shifting our weight as we change the legs. So fifth position to start, arm bra bar. Again, if you're struggling with the fifth, you can do third position for this, but Annabelle, you're okay in your fifth. So we're gonna prepare the arm to second on the intro. Five, six, seven, 
eight. Two back montages of one in two counts. Sliding front and close. Front, shift the weight onto that closing foot to do one with the inside leg derriere. Close fifth, then the weight center, demi plie, squeeze it out again, arm first to second. Two back montages in second, side, cross behind, side, cross in front, the weight is still over the supporting foot as you degage the third one. Transfer to second straight legs, T let go of the bar, arms in second, so the weight center, then you're gonna degage, transfer the weight back over the supporting foot, close derriere. Repeat from the back, two tendus, to the back, transfer onto the back foot as you change legs, one with the inside leg devon, again demi plie weight center, arm first to second. Two tendu side, front, side, back, degage, lower straight, in the center, transfer back and close fifth, keep the arm in second because we're gonna repeat the whole thing again. And then the last time just close the bra bar. Have you got that? Okay, Annabelle, let's take some notes on our back montage. With transference of weight, we're changing legs, but I want you to first be aware about the closing positions and how you get there. So you prepare the arm to second. We take our two back montages devon. I want you to think every time when you're going devon, you lead with your working heel, go through the whole of the foot. Then as you return, retract the toes and lead with the working toes back into fifth. So it's not just the end positions, it's how you get there as well. So take your two tendus devant, leading with the heel front, toes back, heel leads. Now as you close the last one, you've got to anticipate the transference of weight because we're gonna take the inside leg derriere, that's it. So you've shifted your left hip over your left toes, ready to release the back foot. Now going to the back, it's the opposite to Devon, so you want to think of the toes leading out, good, and then the heel leading in, that's it. Now the weight goes central for our demi-plie, again, squeeze it out, keeping the posture maintained and open. Two in second, two tendu, so the weight stays over your supporting toes, close back, again through the foot, close front, degage, keep the weight where it is. Now you're gonna transfer into second, so the weight goes center, with the elbows nicely supported. And then when you degage back, make sure your right hip goes over your right toes. So you're right over your supporting leg and then close derriere. Good, then you repeat the whole thing from the back. So toes lead out, heel leads in, toes lead out, lead in, transfer and inside leg devon. Heel leads, toes come back and demi plie weight center and stretch. Two times your second through the foot and close. I want you to feel like you're caressing the floor with the underneath foot, that's lovely. Close behind, last one, degage, get the weight center, and then transfer back and close front. Good girl. Preparing the arm to second, here we go. Back on tendu devon, out, toes back, heel leads, toes back, change weight. Weight center, plie, squeeze out, two in second over the supporting toes, now transfer to center and back. Derriere, toes lead, heel in. Nice, tight fist, change legs. Demi squeeze, keep the core engaged. So we're isolating the movement. Transfer center and back, repeat. And heel leads, toes back. Change legs, get center and squeeze. Stretch, set, can't. Brushing the floor, that's it. Working the muscles under the feet. Last time, derriere, heel in, nice tight fist, change legs, squeeze it out, stretch, out, good, now watch the elbows as you lower to second and degage, fifth, brava, good girl. Preparing the arm to second, here we go, back one tendu devon, out, toes back, heel leads, toes back, change weight, weight centre, plie, squeeze out, two in second. Over the supporting toes, now transfer to center and back. Derriere, toes lead, heel in. Nice tight fist, change legs. Demi squeeze, keep the core engaged. So we're isolating the movement. Transfer center and back. Repeat, and heel leads, toes back. Change legs, get center and squeeze. Stretch, set, can't. Brushing the floor, that's it. Working the muscles under the feet. Last time, derriere, heel in, nice tight fist, change legs, squeeze it out, stretch, out, good, now watch 
the elbows as you lower to second and the gage fifth brava. Good girl. Okay, let's take our batmon glisse again with the transference of weight, similar format to the batmon tonju. So we start in fifth position, preparing the arm to second, five, six, seven, eight. Batmon glisse with the accent out. I want you to feel like your foot's like a dart just off the floor. So we're going to push out and in and out. Transfer. Inside leg, one to the back. Instead of the demi, we're going to do a rise, arm to first, lowering with the heels forward, eight. Two in second, glisse, close, glisse, close. Third one, into a squeeze, plie, second. Make sure the weight's center again. Transfer back of the supporting toes. A bit of power in that working foot, close derriere. Repeat from the back, glisse, close, glisse, transfer. Inside leg, devon, arise and lower. Two in second, glisse, close front, glisse, close back. One more, glisse into squeeze plie, push, just off the floor again, not too high, and close fifth front, and bra bar to finish. Okay, let's take some notes for our Batmon Glisse exercise, Annabelle. So, um, similar format to the Batmon Tonju with the transference of weight and the same principle, even though the foot's coming an inch off the floor for the Batmon Glisse, I still want you to feel that you're leading with the heel de Von, retracting back with the toes into a nice tight fifth. Again, heel leads, toes back. Then, yeah, anticipate as you close that last leg, transfer onto it again to release the back foot to glisse derriere, leading with the toes, coming in with the heel. Then we're going to do a rise instead of a demi plie, taking the arm to first. Again, keeping the weight over the balls of the feet as you lower, turning up from the tops of the legs, heels forward. Good. Then two in second. Imagine your foot's like a dart. That's it. Cross behind. Push. Cross front. Then one more. Soft plie, weight center again, and then you're going to shift back over the supporting toes and close derriere. Repeat from the back, toes lead and heel in. Toes lead, heel in, transfer, heel leads, tight fifth, rise and lower and second. And second. And then out, plie. Now I want you to feel as you push, almost like you're doing a jump. If you're in the center jumping, you're going to push from the working foot to glisse height as you go back so we get the power. That's lovely. Close fifth and bra bar. See, we're working the strength in the foot for our Allegro in the center. Well done. And preparing the arm, accent out, foot like a dart. Change legs and rise up. Two in second, swish, go swish. And soft plie and foot, good, derriere. Heel in, change legs, rising up. Low and push, energize the foot, plie and push and close. Bravo, good girl. And preparing the arm, accent out, foot like a dart, change legs and rise up. Two in second, swish, go swish, and soft plie and foot, good, derriere. Heel in, change legs, rising up, low and push. Energize the foot, plie and push and close. Bravo, good girl. Okay, Annabelle, let's take our Ronde de Jambes à terre exercise. Starting first position, but we're facing the bar for this one. Arms, bra, bar. You're gonna prepare the arms onto the bar in the preparation. Starting with the right leg, on day or. So we're gonna lead with the right heel, Devon, one. Taking a quarter run to second, maintaining the turnout, close first. Repeat quarter, on day or, second, first. On the third one, we're gonna do a full round. Again, maintaining the turnout all the way around to the back and heel forward into first. Changing legs, left leg, left heel leads, quarter on day or. Repeat Devon, second, first. And then the full, maintaining the turnout all the way around to the back, bringing the heel into first. Repeat with the right leg all on the don now. So leading with the working toes, bringing the heel forward to second and first. Repeat back, quarter first. And then your full, all the way around, bringing the heel forward, toes back, left leg on the don. Quarter run, keeping your hips square to the bar. And third one, 
heel forward, rotating the leg turned out. Close first, finishing with the paw de bras to the side, left arm up, lift the body and bend from the waist, two, recover three, taking the bar four, right arm up, frame your face, bend from the waist and recover back to the bar. Then squeeze out your demi-plie, making sure the arches are supported so we're not rolling. One, two, gently lift the heels, three, four, making sure that's it, the weight's evenly distributed on all 10 toes. Pull up your thighs and knees, six, balance, seven, eight. Open to second, and then keeping weight over the balls of the feet, control the heels down to bra bar. Let's go over some notes for our rond de jambe à terre. So primarily we're warming up the hip sockets with our rond de jambe à terre. So we want to really maintain the stability of the pelvis and not move it. So isolate the movement with the leg. So starting with the right leg, we're going to do quarter rond de jambes en day or. So same principle as your tonjon glisse we've just done. So as we go devon, think of the right heel leading forward. So we're turning out to the devon. Then quarter run to second, maintaining that turnout so we're not going beyond our second and then the leg rotating in. So we're there, hips nice and square to the bar. Close first, repeat again, heel leads, keeping that heel forward and close first. Now we're going to go into the full run, leading with the working heel, turning out to second and then keep, keep lifting off the supporting hip as you rotate to the back, maintaining the turnout, close first. Good girl. Repeat with the left leg, so the left heel feeling leading forward, quarter first. Repeat, hip still, quarter first. And then the full rond, keeping the hips, especially as you pass to arabesque, keep the hips nice and square and close first. Then we repeat with the right leg on the don, so now we lead with the toes. Now I want you to feel the heel coming forward, legs slightly in front of the hips, so we're nice and square to the bar. Close first, repeat again, and bring the heel forward, hips square to the bar, close first, lead with the toes for our full rond de jambe, heel forward, heel forward, keep working that heel forward so we're there, and close first. Left leg, left heel leads, hips isolated, and first. Repeat, back, quarter, that's it. Drawing quarter little circles, now half a circle, all the way around to the front, keep working the heel forward, and close first. Good girl. Pour de bras, again, keep the pelvis where it is, just lift the body and bend from the waist, turn the head towards the direction you're bending, and recover. Right arm up, bend from the waist, legs vertically down to the floor and recover into our demi-plie squeeze. Can we feel the floor? Heels down, arches nice and supported. So we're turning up from the hip socket. Roll up, making sure the weight's on all 10 toes. Then we pull up the quads and the kneecaps. Tummy muscles are engaged and we're ready to let go for our balance with the elbows nicely supported from the lats, back muscles. Open to second isolate the movement and control down over the balls of the feet to finish. Good girl. on the dawn, toes lead, working the heel forward and again, and forearm, working the heel forward, hips square and close, left leg, side, and it. toes lead, working the heel forward and keep the hips front, round, all the way round, first to close, pour the bra to the right, lift and bend from the waist, Take a breath and lengthen the spine before you bend. Good girl. Now two counts to squeeze out the demi-plie, supporting the arches. Smoothly roll up, keeping the weight on all ten toes and thighs pulling up 
knees locked, tummy zipped, and test. And open to second, and then controlling down through the feet to bra bar. Good girl. Opposite heel close, left leg to one quarter, and heel leads, turning out to second, and then your full rond de jambe all the way around, turning out to the back. Repeating on the dawn, toes lead, working the heel forward, and again, and full rond, working the heel forward, hips square, and close. Left leg. Round first to close. Pull the bra to the right. Lift and bend from the waist. Good. Take a breath and lengthen the spine before you bend. Good girl. Now two counts to squeeze out the demi plie, supporting the arches. Smoothly roll up, keeping the weight on all ten toes and thighs pulling up. Knees locked, tummy zipped, and test. And open to second and then controlling down through the feet to bra bar. Okay, Annabelle, we're gonna take our Batman Fondue exercise. First time at air, then the second half when we repeat it, we'll take the leg to 45 degrees on layer. So starting in fifth position, arm bra bar, standing tall. You're gonna take a Batman Fondue Devon. Always think of peeling the toes off the floor to coup de pied Devon. One, and extend two to degage height with the arm first. Repeat to second, knee back, arm and leg to second. You're gonna do coupe on the and, coupe under. Changing legs again, inside leg peels off the floor, the foot to degage. And then you're gonna draw up to fifth, taking the arms to first, and then lowering back down to fifth, arm second, and bra bar down on the and. Repeat from the back, peel the toes off. Arm and leg arrives together. Knee back. Arm and leg to second, coupe over on and, changing legs, inside leg to degage back, rising up, arms first and lowering arms to second, bra bar on and, repeat the whole sequence at 45 degrees, peeling the toes off the floor, one, leading with the heel two, arms are the same, in first, knee leads back, arm and leg to second, 45, coupe under and, inside leg devon, leading with the working heel, rise straight into fifth, arm first, open second and bra bar to the back, 45 degrees, arms first, leading in with the heel and second, coupe over on and, change legs, inside leg, lifting the thigh to arabesque, drawing up to fifth, arm first and you're going to stay Transfer onto the back foot, peel the front toes into your coup de pied devon. Lock the position, make sure your weight's over your supporting toes and test your balance. Close fifth, take the bar and then lower down to bra bar to finish. Okay, Annabelle, let's just go through some notes and the mechanics of a good Batman fondue. What does fondue mean? To melt. Melt. So I want you to imagine your legs are like those cheese strings, yeah? So melting kneecaps, nice and soft. And also, it's all about the coordination of both legs, stretching and bending at the same time. So um, we're in fifth position. <clears throat> so we're going to take our Batman Fondue Devon à terre first. So again, the mechanics, we want to peel the toes off the floor into fondue, coup de pied Devon. And bit like a developé, the knee is back, you're going to lead with your working heel and both knees extend at the same time. Yeah, à terre, let's do the à terre. So I want you to coordinate the knees, they bend together and then stretch together. So basically one leg is moving slightly faster than the other and that would be the working leg because it's got further to go. So can we just time that? So seven and eight, Batman fondue one and Two, good, same in second. Knee leads back three, and second four. Coupe under, this is where we shift the weight onto the back foot to release the front foot, 
that mom fond you, leading with the heel two, and then draw up to fifth, weight centered, and then lower the heels, arms to second. Bra bar, repeating from the back. Again, knee tracking back as you bat one fondue. Lead with the thigh, good girl. Then knee back and lead in with the heel. Arm and leg to second, coupe over. And inside leg derriere, shifting the weight, that's it. To degage derriere, good girl, rising up and lower. Then we're going to repeat the whole sequence on layer at 45 degrees. So again, the peels, toes peel, working heel leads. That's it, both knees bend, both knees stretch at the same time. Coupe under and inside leg and heel leads, rising up and lower and repeat from the back. Melt, fondue and extend melting knees and stretch. Coupe over and inside leg, dairy air rising up and then we stay. Now weight central to start, then we shift onto the back foot to be able to release the front foot to our coup de pied. And that's a nice shape foot. We want to avoid any sickles in these low coup de pied positions, yes. So think of heel forward, toes back, super glue the toe on the top of the ankle bone there. Weight should be supporting hip directly over the supporting toes. Core muscles engaged, ready to let go. And then take the bar. Can we lift the body into a nice tight fifth? And then control down to bra bar. Good girl. Okay, standing tall. Batman fond de bon to degage height. Coordinating the knees. Both knees bend, both knees stretch. Coupe under, inside leg to degage, drawing up to fifth and low from the back. Bat mon fondue to degage. Arm and leg to second. Coupe over, inside leg, derriere. Degage, rise up and low. Repeat 45 de Vaughan. Heel leads, knee back. And second, coupe under, inside leg, devant, rising up, good girl. Last time to the back, 45, arm and leg to second, coupe over, inside leg, lift the thigh, rising up and stay, transferring onto the back foot. Make sure the weight stays over the right toes. Lock it and test. Take the bar and lift into fifth, tight fifth, and controlling down to bra bar. Okay, standing tall, bat mon fond de bon to degage height. Coordinating the knees, both knees bend, both knees stretch, coupe under, inside leg to degage, drawing up to fifth and low from the back. Bat mon fondue to degage. Arm and leg to second. Coupe over, inside leg, derriere. Degage. Rise up and low. Repeat 45 de Vaughan. Heel leads. Knee back and second. Coupe under, inside leg, de Vaughan. Rising up. Good girl. Last time to the back. 45. Arm and leg to second, coupe over, inside leg. Lift the thigh, rising up and stay. Transferring onto the back foot. Make sure the weight stays over the right toes. Lock it and test. And take the bar and lift into fifth, tight fifth, and controlling down to bra bar. Good girl. Okay, let's take our Batman frappe exercise. Starting in fifth position, arm bra bar. On the introduction, you're gonna to prepare to second, five, six, degage to second with the arm, and then you're gonna place the foot to flex in front with the arm bra bar. You're gonna take three Batman frappes de Vaughan in even counts, holding out slightly, out and in. Out and in, out. On the third one, you're gonna flex the foot, and the toe should be pointing to the side, that's it. Then stretch through the whole foot, and place flex. Same in second, strike, close, strike, in. Strike, flex toes up, through the whole of the foot, flex derriere. 
derriere, strike in, strike in, strike, flexing the toes should be pointing to the side again, stretching through the whole foot and in. Then the last time, just two Batman frappes to the second side, close, side plie front in fifth, tummy held, releve straight up to fifth, and then draw up to pirouette position, super glue the toes underneath the knee, and a quick little balance. Close fifth, take the bar, and lower down to bra bar to finish. Have you got that? Good. Okay, Annabelle, let's talk about the mechanics and musicality for a good Batman frappe. Firstly, what does frappe mean? To strike. Okay, so if you take your flex position at the beginning, yes, if we're doing the Batman frappe on flat, you're striking with slow motion the ball of the foot and then the toe comes just an inch off the floor, basically your glissé height, yeah? So, we take our preparation, we're in fifth, you're going to degage it to second with the arm and place with the flex to the front bra bar, knee back, that's it. So um, it's an even count, but what I would like is slight syncopation. So you're going to do a little hold and in and hold and in. So the foot's like a dart pointing to the floor. Can you do that? And strike and in, hold and in. Hold, now we're gonna flex, and if we're doing our work correctly, just turning up from the hip socket, flex, that's lovely. The toes are pointing to the side, turning up from the hip, and then can we go through the whole of the foot, manipulating the metatarsals, and then flex back in. Make sure the knee always comes back. Then side, and side, and side, flex toes up, through the foot, flex derriere. Now, keep the thigh back and derriere, striking the ball of the foot, in. Ball of the foot, in. Ball of the foot, flex. Good, toe side through the foot and in. Last two in second, strike ball of the foot. Out and plie, maintaining your posture so you go down straight and then you're gonna relevate to fifth, straight up. Immediately transform to the back foot and lift to retire pirouette position. That's it, the retire pirouette position. Ends of the toes just underneath what I call the little nook of the kneecap there, super glued there, turning out from the hips, core muscles engaged, supporting hip over supporting toes, ready to let go for a quick balance, show that you're on your leg, take the bar and again lengthen the spine into fifth and control down. Good girl. And to gadget to second and place. Strike! In, hold out, syncopation holding out, flex through and in, striking the floor, strike, little hold with the flex through the foot, derriere, striking all of the foot, pull up off the supporting hip and out and flex, just two in second, striking out, little hold, plie, releve fifth and glue the toes, stomach muscles, Lengthen the spine and lower. Good girl, well done. And to gadget to second and place. Strike, in, hold out. Syncopation holding out. Flex, through and in. Striking the floor. Strike, little hold with the flex through the foot. Derriere, striking all of the foot. Pull up off the supporting hip and out and flex. Just two in second, striking out. Little hold, plie, releve fifth. And glue the toes. Stomach muscles. Lengthen the spine and lower. Good girl, well done. Okay, Annabelle, let's take our petty batman. Um, isolation of the thigh, I want you to feel like the lower leg is like a pendulum working sideways. So let's start fifth position, facing the bar. You're gonna prepare the arms onto the bar, degage to second with the right leg, and then fully stretch foot to coup de pied devant. Hold that thigh back. You're gonna take two petit batmons slow, going back, front, and then a quick one, back, front. Repeat that twice more. Slow, slow, and quick. Slow, slow and quick. Close fifth in front, degage back foot to second and replace the foot to coup de pied other side. Keep the thigh still and it goes slow, slow and quick. Slow, slow and quick. Slow, slow and quick. Close fifth, degage over and fifth to finish. Have you got that? Good. 
Okay, Annabelle, let's talk about the mechanics of a petit battement, trying to isolate the thigh muscle and thinking of the lower leg like a pendulum working sideways, a small movement. So take the hands on the bar, you dégagé to second with the right leg and you place coup de pied devant. Tummy muscles engage, weight over the supporting toe. That's, to, that's it. Knee held out, you're gonna hold that thigh still and just relax from the knees downwards. And the petit battement is gonna go sideways movement out and back then out and front, out and back, out and front, like that. So we're keeping that thigh still, just working the lower leg. Try that, too slow and then a quick, and slow, slow and then a quick, and slow, slow and quick, good girl. Slow, slow and quick, close into a tight fifth, dégagez the left leg, coup de pied devant, and hold that thigh back. So again, lower leg goes out and in, back and front, and quick. Out, back, and front, and quick. Isolate the thigh, and good girl. Close fifth, dégagé over, and close fifth to finish. Okay. And place out, and in, back, front, and quick. Thigh still, isolate the thigh. Lower leg, working sideways, good. Tight fifth to change. Could appear, and side, side, thigh still. Lower leg like a pendulum sideways. Slow, slow and quick. Closing fifth, dégagé and fifth to finish. Good girl. Okay. And place out and in. Back, front and quick. Thigh still, isolate the thigh. Lower leg working sideways, good. Tight fifth to change. Could appear and side, side, thigh still. Lower leg like a pendulum sideways. Slow, slow and quick. Closing fifth, dégagé and fifth to finish. Good girl. Okay, Annabelle, we're going to take a little demi grand ronde de jambe exercise, um, all in the on the or direction. We're going to change legs and also um, introduce fouette and rotation movements as well. So let's start fifth position. Sideways to the bar, arm bra bar. And we're going to start with a demi grand ronde de jambe en dehors, starting with the front foot. Two counts for each position. One, two, arm goes to first. Leading with the working heel. Three, four, arm and leg opens to second for the demi grand. Five, six, and then two counts to lower. Seven, to dégagé, eight. Now, you're going to fouette to face the bar with the working foot à terre into arabesque, but you're going to initiate the fouette with your supporting heel. Two counts, one to face the bar, two. Then you're gonna lift the leg to arabesque, tracking it in line with your hip, three, four, and then two counts to lower, five, six, and then you're gonna lift into fifth behind, that's it, and change legs, developer to second with the front leg, one, up the side of the leg, two. A la second, three, four. Demi grand ronde de jambe, on the or to the back, six, two counts to lower, seven, and eight, and we hold the dégagé, then we're gonna do two count rotation to take you to the second side. One, two, placing the leg beautifully turned out in second. You're gonna lift the leg in second, three, four, lowering five to dégagé, six, close fifth in front, bra bar, ready to go second side straight away. One, knee back, two, heel leads three, four, demi grand ronde de jambe on dehors, five, six, two counts to lower, seven, eight. Initiating with the supporting heel, pivot two counts, one, to face the bar, two. Lengthen the leg away, three, four, good girl. Lowering five, six, squeeze the fifth in, seven, and eight. Front leg to second, up the side of the leg, two. Develop a second, three, four. Demi grand ronde jump to arabesque, five, six. Degage seven, it gets there, eight. Rotation away from the bar to second, one, two. Lift, three four, low to dégagé, five, six, close in front, seven, and then a demi plié to just stretch out the Achilles and calf muscles to finish, and then bravo. And starting with the devil bit of on, knee back, working heel leads, turning out, demi grand on the jump to second, slowly low to dégagé, now supporting heel initiates the fouette to the bar. Leg directly behind as you lengthen the leg and lift. Slowly lower and squeeze into fifth area. 
changing legs, go from here to second, tracking up the side of the leg, turning up the second, lift the body as you're doing, run to the back, and look to the gage and hold, retest on the way from the bar, rotating the hip socket as you lift, set, hold, low to gage, goes fifth divan and brava, second side, knee back straight away, that's it, working your leads, Low to dégagé, hold, supporting heel initiates the fouette to the bar. Leg in line with the hip as you lengthen the arabesque up. Slowly dégagé, squeeze into fifth behind, changing legs, develop to second, up the side. And turning out, lifting the body as you run to the back. Low to dégagé. Closing fifth of on, rub up and plie, squeeze out the Achilles and the calves and rub up. Good girl, well done. And starting with the devil of Devon, knee back, working your knees. Turning out, you don't need one on the jump to second. Slowly going to the gage, now supporting heel initiates the fouette to the bar. Leg directly behind as you lengthen the leg and lift. Slowly lower and squeeze into fifth area. Changing legs, go from here to second, tracking up the side of the leg. Turning up the second, lift the body as you don't need to run to the back. And low to the gage and hold. Retest on the way from the bar. Rotating the hip socket as you lift, set, calm. Low to gage. Goes fifth of on and brava. Second side, knee back straight away. That's it. Working your leads. Maintaining the turn up from the demi grand on the jump. Low to dégagé, hold. Supporting heel initiates the fouette to the bar. Leg in line with the hip as you lengthen the arabesque up. Slowly dégagé. Squeeze into fifth behind. Changing legs. Develop to second up the side. And turning out. On to the back, low to the gage, hold, retest the arm, and lifting to second, slow to the gage, closing fifth of on, rub up, and plie, squeeze out the Achilles and the calves, and rub up. Good girl, well done. Okay, Annabelle, let's take our Grand Batman exercise with Retire and Retire Passe. Um, standing in fifth position, sideways to the bar, arm bra bar. We're taking on a polonaise, so you've got a two bar introduction, one and a two and three, two and a two and three. You're going to do a grand, one Grand Batman de Vaughan with the accent up, controlling it down. So up and a lower down. Retire de Vaughan, up, straight to Retire, close front. Grand Batman second, closing the Vaughan. Second and close front into retire passe derriere. So the front foot lifts to the front of the knee, directly fifth behind. Grand Batman derriere and close. Retire derriere, so toes back of the knee, close back, and then two tonges with the accent out, fifth out, changing fifth. Start the whole thing to the back. Grand Batman derriere and close. Retire derriere, close behind. Grand Batman second. Close behind, retire passe devant. So the back foot goes directly to the front of the knee, close front. Grand Batman devant, close front, retire devant, close fifth, and then the two tondus out. Change fifth and out, close front, and then finish bra bar. Okay, let's go through some notes for the Grand Batman. So, strengthening the legs for our Allegro, particularly Grand Allegro. So, um, musicality. We're on a polonaise, so think about the rhythm. You're going to do Grand Batman with the accent up, controlling it down with the retires, really hitting those positions on the beat. Um, let's just talk through the mechanics of the Grand Batman. So, you prepare the arm to second. Now, Tummy muscles are engaged, glutes are engaged, adductors are rotating up, hamstrings are already engaged, but the power for the Grand Batman is initiating through your foot. So feel a gentle pressure through the foot and imagine it's like you're doing a Batman glisse to initiate the movement and then the underneath, take, underneath thigh takes over. So you're going to do one Grand Batman de Bon, controlling it down to fifth and go up and close. Then our first retire is retire de Bon, 
So the toe goes straight to the knee there. And then you're gonna close it devon. Then we do the same thing, grand back monte, second closing front. Push through the floor, close front. And then a retire, passe derriere. So I need to see two positions, Annabelle. Front of the knee and then directly to fifth derriere. Boom, direct, exactly. Then our grand back monte derriere. You're gonna throw, control down. And then a retire derriere. So toes back of the knee in one. Close behind, and then our two tonges with the accent out, show off the footwork. Push out, close front, and out, close back. Starting from the back, grand back mon derriere, reversing it. Close fifth, retire on one, back of the knee, good, close derriere. Grand back mon second, closing behind, then retire passe devant. Back foot goes directly to the front of the knee on one, right underneath the pirouette position, close front. Then devon, grand batman, close front, retire devon, close front, and then your two tonges with a little accent out, close fifth and out, close fifth, and then bra bar to finish. Have you got that? Good. Two bars in, prepare the arm, leading through the foot, throw control, retire on one, close front, second, close front, passe derriere. Retire, tonju out, and another one out, starting from the back. Throw, control down, hit the retire on one, and second close behind, and passe devant, good go, devant, and hit the position, tonju hold, and hold, and bar bar, good go. In, prepare the arm, leading through the foot, throw control, retire on one, close front, second, close front, passe derriere, back, and retire, tonju out, and another one out, starting from the back, throw, control, down, hit the retire on one, and second, close behind, and passe devant, good go, devant, and hit the position, Tonju, hold, and hold, and bar bar. Good go. Please subscribe, like, and hit the notification bell for Italia Conti Virtual. Online training for the performing arts.